Hey guys, it's me. Um, I wanted to do a little video because uh, I forgot to thank some, some people earlier. Um, or thank, actually I should say thank a person earlier. Um, somebody sent me a, a PayPal donation earlier today. That was so nice. I really, really appreciate that. Um, I know a lot of people are worried about my safety but I promise you, um, I'm prom I promise you I'm fine and I am not intimidated or scared by these people at all. Um, a lot of people think that anxiety and panic or any kind of mental illness makes you weak, um, means you're a weak person and that's so far from the truth. In fact, I think mental health sufferers are one of the strongest people um, in the world uh, because what we have to go through daily, a lot of people wouldn't be able to handle. So, um, uh, yeah, it's not a weakness. Um, I am not afraid of these people, you know, internet bullies are just like any other bullies. They're all talk. Um, and again, like I said, why I may seem weak, I'm definitely not the one you want to cross. Right. I mean, I'm a nice person. I, at least I try to be, but, um, yeah. So I'm not, you know, I'm not worried about about any of that. Um, I can't talk a whole lot about what's happening now um, because I have been advised um, not to. Um, I can only say talk about in certain ways and certain things. So, but rest assured, um, everything is chugging along like it's supposed to. Slow, slow process, but uh, yeah. Uh, it is what it is. You know, um, when we say things and do things that are not good, we need to be held accountable and continuing to, to rage on and stuff. Um, and this is for anybody, you know, it's, it's not, well, you're not holding yourself accountable. Then you're blaming everybody else for, um, your bad behavior and, uh, that's not how society works. That's not how the law works. That's not how any of this works. So, um, yeah. Uh, I have like this gigantic pounder of a headache. And it always happens. My cheeks are actually bleeding. And it's because um, the skin, you know, I, when I get upset and everything gets red and inflamed. Um, and then I have this weird skin condition. So, you know, tears have salt in it. And when they come down, it's, it's like, I, I swear to God, it's like I cry fire or something. But anyway, that's part of why I'm not on camera right now. <clears throat> because they've just gotten worse from earlier's video. I mean, they could stick me out. down. I can go a couple blocks down the road here. They can stick me in the sand and I could be a beacon for ships in the night. That's how <laughs> bad my cheeks are right now. Um, <clears throat> um, oh, there was so much other stuff I wanted to say. And I can't think of it. Of course. This is why I, I almost always put write down notes because I, I forget stuff so easily. It never fails. I'll be like, oh, I want to get on and talk about this and this and this. And then I, I, you know, five minutes after logging off and stopping a video, I'm like, oh, crap, I was going to say this or that, you know. Um, but again, I want to thank everybody for um, their support and their love. Um, it means a lot. Uh, I know I sound down. I'm still I'm still in the throes of a panic attack. And I and I am, you know, I'm not gonna lie, I am feeling down, you know. Uh <clears throat> it was uh you know, the things that were said were just awful and the justification that people were giving for it was just awful too. You know, I actually had somebody in fact I screenshot it. I actually had someone tell me in a comment that uh, they never heard any this person ever say anything bad about me, ever. It's always just been me saying bad. And I'm like, what? So, you know, when you're dealing with that kind of delusional and delusion, you know, type people, there's you're not going to ever... Um, win any argument you're not going to ever get them to understand that they're not thinking you know in the right mind or whatever um and uh 
at that point, the only thing you can hope for, you know, is that uh, YouTube's crappy blocking system works. That's about all you can hope for at that point, right? Um, so, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I'm definitely not weak. And um, this definitely isn't being just shoved into the corner um, or shoved under the rug. Um, it's a process. Process takes time. Um, but, uh, but it is going forward. So, um, again, I, uh, <clears throat> I can't believe how, my voice is so hoarse. That's crazy. You'd think I yelled or something and I, I, you know, I don't yell. I can't stand yelling. It drives me nuts, but, but that's part of my PTSD. In fact, I can't have anybody in my house yelling. They start yelling, out the door they go. <laughs> I just can't, I can't deal. So, you guys see my Peach Please sticker? I think that's so funny. I love stickers. Stickers, um, stickers really, really help me out. Um, it's hard when you're somebody like me, you know, I'm paranoid of COVID, so I can't, I can't really go anywhere, right? Because I just, it makes me so nervous. I mean, I like triple mask, right? Um, and so, and I'm, and I'm vaccinated, but still scares the crap out of me. So I, uh, I don't go, I, you know, it, it, it just generally when things like this happen, if I feel like I can leave my house, I like to leave my house and maybe go, like I said, like, you know, window shop or just walk on the sand or, or what have you. But, um, because of COVID, I can't really, I just, I'm paranoid about going out. And so it's, you know. It's just hard. You know, you have to, you're in your house and, you know, because of physical and mental problems, you can't really get out a whole lot. So this is your, your, you know, this is my social life is right here. And, and I know people are going to clip that and they're going to make fun of me. They've been making fun of me all day though. You know, I, from, I, I'm sure that every move I make now is going to be scrutinized and laughed at and poked fun of. But like I said, you know, that just, internet bullies for you they'd never have the guts to do it to my face you know or anybody's face um but that's internet bullying for you especially in men and i'm not trying to be sexist here i'm really not because obviously women are internet bullies too <laughs> but i just don't understand men who who like sit and call women i was called some horrific names today um and that my husband saw from a male that's on here that is a well-known male and um and I'm not going to mention names because I'm not going to give him the satisfaction uh but you know the first thing my husband said was like is this men don't act like this and I'm like well no they don't if they're secure in themselves they do not act like this they do not treat women like this so you know I mean it's just I feel bad for my husband like he like I said before he's he doesn't do YouTube I mean he mods for me but if he's on YouTube at all ever, it's because he plays Minecraft and he's watching some Minecrafter person. I mean, seriously, that's it. For the most part, he's working and um, he's just not into this whole YouTube thing uh, at night. If I, if it's later in the evening and, I, and I've got a, a, a live, somebody's live is going, you know, and I don't have earphones on. He, you know, he hears uh, everything and stuff. And and um, so he knows he's he's beginning to know a lot of people by name, you know, but it was just, he was just, he was floored. I mean, we knew I was going to get, I was going to get clapped back because, you know, people are ignorant. You know, there's always, you can tell somebody the sky is blue and they're going to scream why it's not blue, why it's purple. You know, there's always going to be those types of people. You can't get away from it. It's, those, it's willful ignorance. They, they like to live, you know, uh, they like they like to to live in their own web of ignorance. And no, I'm not insulting anybody. It is the absolute truth. If you are shown, I mean, how many? What is it? Natasha says, or people tell me Natasha, don't. What 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 is it? She says, oh, when people show you who they are, believe them. Y'all need to keep that in mind. Not, nobody in my community needs to keep that in mind. It's other communities y'all need to keep that in mind. When someone shows you who they really are, y'all need to believe it. 
um, but, uh, but, but, but really I want to reassure, I'm, I'm looking, I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm still getting comments. These are the good comments though. These are the ones that, that have kept me, uh, um, from really having a severe panic attack today. Uh, people in my community, um, it's been nothing but straight love all day long, literally all day long. Um, even my husband was, he was just, he was like, I, I'm so glad that you have the support that you have you know, um, on there. And, uh, and I do, you know, um, and I'm very appreciative of it. That's for damn sure. Um, but it, somebody just said across the thing that, you know, well, we're really worried about you. Um, you guys don't have to, if you're worried about me as far as like someone physically harming me, you don't have to worry about that at all. Okay. At all. I swear to you, you guys do not have to worry about that at all. Like I said, anxiety is not weakness. And people would be really stupid to assume that it is. Um, I'm one of the strongest people I know. And I can say that. Yeah, I can pat myself on the back. I have survived three near-death experiences. I've talked about that. That's what that tattoo on my chest means. Um, I have it on my chest. So when I'm really, really, really down and feeling like a worthless piece of crap, I know I can stand in front of a mirror and I can see that. I can look down and I can see it. So that it it's like a so it's like a, a virtual slap in the face of how strong I really am. Um and I think that's probably why the accusations bothered me as like they did, because that's the exact opposite of what I am and what I'm striving and, and you know, the person that I'm striving to be. And I just I you know, liars, I don't I just don't I don't deal with lies. If somebody lies on me. I'm going to defend myself. I mean, it depends on the line. It depends on the person. But if if somebody's going to outright lie about me, if someone is going to to attack my my art, if somebody's going to attack my family or my friends, especially when my friends' children can read and hear some of the comments, yeah, I'm going to defend myself, and I'm gonna I'm gonna call out whoever does it. I don't I don't. Uh, I don't um, condone bad behavior. I don't baby people um, because, you know, I mean, <laughs> I've said before, and I'm, and I'm going to continue saying it, <clears throat> nobody helps anybody when you're condoning bad behavior. If the words, I know, but, ever comes out when it, it when we're talking about somebody with bad behavior and that goes for anybody anybody with bad behavior if your thought process is I know but or you say out loud I know but now you need to scrub that butt <laughs> scrub that butt in other words get that butt out of that conversation because uh no no we don't contone we don't condone bad behavior so um just because I'm down and out right now um doesn't uh it doesn't mean i'm weak it doesn't mean i'm in, in any danger i am not i am uh i have my community is holding me up i have my husband i have my beautiful children i have my beautiful grandchildren um i have it all i really do i have everything i need to keep my mental head above water um, I guess the bright side of this is, uh, if you want to look at it that way, um, I only need like, uh, like 120 more people and I'm at a thousand. I hit my watch hours a long time ago because I don't delete any of my stuff. I hit my watch hours a long time ago. I'm way over 4,000, but, um, yeah, I, 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 I only need a hundred and something more. So, um, you know, that's a good thing. You know, uh, <clears throat> I can say my channel grew organically. And I can say that, I mean, do I have haters that are, that are watching me? Well, of course I do. It's YouTube. Do I have haters that subscribe to me? Well, of course I do. It's YouTube. You know, when, when people realize that they're not going to see a, a, a war, 
um, between me and somebody else, you know, they might, they you might leave and my, my subscriptions might go down, but that's okay. Cause my whole point of my channel is not just drama. My, my, uh, channel is, um, it's about, you know, everything, mental health, my, my work, my art as it pertains to, um, business wise I, I don't really it's not really I don't really call it a business it's a hobby really that sometimes I get to make money off of but however you look at it you know um, my channel is a lot of things it's not just one thing that's why you know no matter what happens I, I know I'll always have con content it may not be content that's you know that everybody likes but it's content and it doesn't depend on on a certain person or anything like that you know to keep going it only depends on me yeah so, um, so yeah, you know, uh, so that, that's a good thing, um, that, that, that's happening. Um, I've had a lot of people ask me, uh, you know, about my links. I, I don't want to put them in my community, um, posts because that's just, that just reminds me too much of what somebody else does. Um, my links are always in my about section. Um, I don't, I just feel weird putting them in my community posts, uh, because I'm not about that. Um, and while I, while it helps, I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to, not going to say it doesn't. Um, it helps mentally and it helps financially. I mean, duh, you know, and when I say duh, I don't mean, you know, Ru I just mean that, you know, I mean, who doesn't like gifts or money? I mean, everybody does, right? Um, but that's not what, that's not what, um, what I'm about. I'm, I still feel weird when somebody gives me a donation or if I get an Amazon gift. I do. I, I'm hoping that at some point in time that feeling will pass, but you know, I always talk about, you know, not feeling worthy. Well, let me tell you, it's sometimes it's really hard. I mean, I'm not complaining by any means. It's just, it's just weird that I grew up with parents you know, sp specifically my father, you know, who just did not want to hear me. Um, I, you know, I was always less than as I was growing up. And I was told that, I mean, literally I was less than this. I was less than my older brother. I was less than, and it, that continued, that continued all the way through my, my adult years. Um, because when you're raised that way, you believe it. So you tend to seek out relationships that that subconsciously treats you the same way. I mean, you don't try to. It's just that subconsciously you're drawn because you don't think you're worthy. Does that make sense? So it's really, it's it's weird for me, you know. Um, like when I got the big box on Mother's Day, you know, I burst out in tears. You know, I cry about everything. I swear to God. I cry, I cry when I'm happy. I'm, I cry when I'm sad. I cry when I'm angry. Um, but those were good tears. Um, and it just... You know, and, and I've talked to that subscriber since then about that. And that, that was just, that that's going to stay in my memories forever. Just, that was just the neatest thing. Um, when I was a kid, I, we didn't celebrate, we weren't allowed to celebrate Christmas because of my parents' weird religious stuff. Uh, so I didn't get to believe in Santa Claus or the Tooth Fairy. Um, in fact, I wasn't even allowed to celebrate birthdays until I was in my teens. Um and I don't tell anybody, I don't tell you that out of pity. I just, I'm telling you that out of, so you can understand why it's, it's, it's weird to me that people want to give me gifts or monetary donations when I'm just talking. You know, I, it's, I feel like my words really, how, how do I want to phrase this? That what I'd say is just not that important that it, that it, deserves a gift or anything like that so it's it's so this has been a hard time for me <laughs> I mean again I'm not complaining believe me um I just I'm I'm upset that I cannot have the that I'm not at that point yet where I can say I'm proud of of what I'm doing here on my channel and stuff like that this am I making I hope I'm making sense I always feel like I'm rambling but, uh, you know, so what are you going to do?
you know, I am what I am. And, uh, uh, it's, <laughs> it's like my husband says, he says, it, it, this is, every day is like a Christmas to me when stuff like that happens because, you know, you all are like my Santa Clauses. Does that sound stupid? I know it sounds stupid, but it's so weird for me to get gifts from people who don't, aren't obligated to give me a gift. You know what I mean? Like family, you know, they're kind of obligated to get you something or else they're going to look like jerks, you know, on Christmas or something. So it's amazing to me that people want to do that for me and they don't even know me in real life. It's, it's mind boggling to me. Um, and I, I, and I love you guys for it, you know, anyway, I'm going to get weepy and I don't want to get weepy. I did not hydrate enough. I think I've cried more than I've got, had put water in me. So I'm fully expecting the next time I sneeze, there just to be, you know, a cloud of dust is going to come flying through. Sorry, I got to drink some water. Anyway, I'm going to let you guys go. Um, um, if Natasha is going live later, I had to leave her chat earlier because I couldn't get people to leave me alone. Um, not anybody in her chat, none, none of my, my people's, but other people, uh, you know, uh, we're, we're just, uh, and, uh, so I'm hoping to catch if she, if she, if she comes back on tonight, um, hopefully I'll be able to go in and relax with you guys and, and, uh, be surrounded by my peeps, right? All right. I'm going to go. Um, I love you guys. Oh, I wanted to show you. Look. Look at that one. Isn't that cool? I love stickers. And then I'm going to leave y'all with this one. I'm still here. I'm still strong. I'm down and out for right now, but I won't be forever. Um, I know that right is on my side. I know the law is on my side. And I know that um, I know who I am. And nobody can tell me different. I know who I am. And I know that um, I have the, the, the moral, ethical, legal high ground. So I'm still here. Still strong, you guys. I don't want anybody to worry. Okay. And like I said, if you're worried, obviously, you know, Remember that I'm in on uh, Pacific Standard Time. I'm on the West Coast of the United States. So <laughs> if you send me an email, please realize if I don't answer right away, it very well could be because I'm sleeping. So sometimes um, I do that. Sometimes I'm like, how come? Oh, yeah, they're in Australia. That's why they're not talking right now. You know, that type of thing. So um, anyway, I love you guys. Uh, I hope you have a really good night. If you made it to the end of this, I really appreciate it. Um, you guys have a good one. And I will see you tonight on the YouTube street somewhere and I will see you tomorrow when I um, make my video. I'll talk to you guys later.